Hello everybody, welcome back. This is Shady here again. And um, we're here with the next part of Resident Evil 2 Remake. Um, obviously we just did like Mansion 1 or whatever you want to call it. Um, you know, uh, the first part anyway. Um, I'll just sort out my inventory here. And yeah, we've got everything ready. Let's reload. Yeah. So basically, yeah, we, we just have to go down here now. Um, pretty much just follow this way down. Um, yeah. So this is pretty much our kind of next major area we're going into now. So just go down here. Really cool looking area, in my opinion. Um, yeah, I decided uh, for this part, drop the quality down to 1080p, just because um, I just realized it's obviously, it takes up a lot of space on the, um, on the um, hard drive there, so recording at 4K plus like upload times are ridiculous. So yeah, no point doing that. Whoa. Hello. Hello. Wonder who that is. Uh, we may find out. Who knows? Okay, so yeah, we can't go that way, but we can go this way. Okay. All right. I'm sure. I'm sure everything's fine. Dude, come on. Hello? Who are you? Hey. It's okay. I won't hurt you, I promise. Hello? What are you doing? Here, take my hand. Oh my god. I'm sorry, I can't understand you. You need help. Thanks. Sorry. That's very lovely of you to say. He's right behind you. What? Yep, so this is G. Oh, Obviously, yeah, if you don't know, G is, um, Obviously, uh, yeah, kind of our main adversary we're going to be seeing. Uh, but yeah, this is the first boss fight of the game now. So, uh, yeah, we can actually get some items. So if we just uh, go around this way, pretty much in each corner, you get some items. So, Dude, leave me alone. Yeah, so, uh, yeah, we pretty much go into each one of these corners, you get yourself some items, so it's pretty cool. Um, obviously, yeah, when you get hit, it's... You get kind of this, like, damage buffer, if you want to call it that. Yeah, and uh, L1, let's use the defense item. Um, we have the thingy equipped. Okay. Obviously, you just shoot his eye. Last thing I want to do is die, so we won't do that. Okay. Yeah, maybe I should move <laughs> when I see him. Did all of those friggin' bullets friggin' miss? 
It's freaking broke camera. Um, and obviously, yeah, he's slowing down as uh, you're damaging him more so. Okay, typical sort of boss thing. So, uh, where have you gone? Another defense item. And I thought that'd be it. There we go. One more hit. Yeah. His eye goes more red as well as you can tell, so that's how you know you're doing more damage to him, so. Uh oh. So yeah, um, not too tough of a fight anyway, so you don't have to worry too much. It's pretty easy. Yeah. It's safe now. Is it's it? Over. Are you sure? Yeah, I promise. Everything's fine. I just need you to lower that ladder for me. Your mom is down here? I think so. I hope so. Doubt it. Yeah. Of course. I'll help you. Okay. And then, yeah, she lowers down the ladder, so we actually have something. Um. Yeah, Claire's not looking too hot right now, so we'll, uh, we'll heal up. And yeah, um, we just have to follow Sherry. Yeah, not doing too well in terms of ammo right now, are we? <laughs> okay, let me press that. It won't move. Yeah, it's because you need to press the lever. You got it! Or so, we'll lever. What's your mom like? Yeah, I bet she is. That big pharmaceutical company? My mom's always at work. I don't get to see her much. Well, hopefully you'll get to see her again soon. Yeah, so obviously, uh, so yeah. Umbrella's always been in background. Uh, but as we know, they're the ones who spread the G, uh, G virus. Well, G virus is new virus. But, um, yeah, they're the ones who. Both of my parents are gone. It's just me and my brother. Oh, I'm sorry. Don't be. It means we've got something in common and. That's a good thing, right? Yeah. Why not? Um, yeah, then we're doing all right. Um, yeah, we'll we'll just we'll take some ammo. Um, we'll make some ammo. Uh, let's just move that there. Yeah, unlike the uh, the older games, you you can't reload in this screen. You have to actually manually do it. Um, yeah, we'll save. Um, I'll make a separate save here, just in case. You never know. Um, and yeah, we just continue on now. Um, up here. And now we're entering the next section. Uh, which is like the sewer type area. So, Well, the parking garage, sorry. Sewer's coming up in a minute. Mm. Everything seems normal. So this is this is strange. You're meant to do this and then exit. You realise you can't use it. You need a key card. 
sure you could fit through the bars. Here, come out. Um, yeah, obviously this area um, was actually in Resident Evil 1.5. Um, well, designed slightly more like this. Obviously the parking garage is in the original, but this design is more similar to um, what it is in that particular version. I think that's one of the first series you start in or something. So. Mm. On the ground, hands behind your head. You can't be serious. On the ground, now. Sherry, tie your hands. Why are you doing this? Shut it? up. Tie her. Okay then. You tie her up now, or she dies. Uh, this is the mayor of Raccoon City. What's this all about? Child endangerment for starters. Sherry, come here. What are you gonna do to her? None of your fucking business. If you hurt her, I swear to God, my brother is stars and I will fuck her. Sherry, get over here. Sorry, police chief, he's not the mayor. He's police chief Irons. What's your name? What's your fucking name? Claire! Sherry? Come with me now, or say goodbye to Claire. Okay, okay, I'll go. You better be taking me to my mom. Absolutely. Don't listen to him, he's full of shit. Stop hurting her, please! Don't tell me how to do my job. Stop! Let me go! Let me go! Obviously nobody taught you manners. We'll fix that. Oh, yes, we will. Let me go! Let me go! You can run pretty fast, can't you? How do you get all the way out there? I mean, he's a big fella as well, so I don't believe that. That's like the most unrealistic so part scary. of the zombie apocalypse game. Okay, so yeah. Um, okay. Now we have this section. First, and then that asshole gets what's coming to him. Yeah, I mean... He is going to get what's coming to him. Don't you worry, Claire. It's fine. Um, yeah, so, first of all, I'm going to show you down here. There's a cool little area down here first that uh, I want to show you guys. Um, yeah, I think it's cool anyway. Yeah, obviously, yeah, we have... That explains who he is. Yeah, he is, I know. Yeah, so, we, obviously, we get a map. Um, yeah, so... Yeah, so this... Oh, sorry. No, 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 it's fine. Yeah, um, that's for later. Um, I was thinking of something else that we'll, we'll get to later. But yeah, now we actually have to go in here. Um, so this area is... Um, yeah, so obviously, um, in the original, we're going to keep talking about the original, um, the parking area is just like that outside bit, pretty much. And all you have to do is, like, get to, um, um, yeah, obviously you can examine, just, just like in RE1 Remake and, like, 7, you can examine stuff and you get items inside these things. So, yeah. Um, and then we can actually go outside with this. But yeah, um, this is actually, like, a, a full-on area. Because before, it's just this area, and I think you have, like, you have a truck blocking this area here. Well, so this area. Um, and then, like, you have to push out of the way. Um, and then, yeah, obviously in this one, they have this full area now. Uh, but yeah, basically, um, again, we examine this. Click it. And then that car opens, and obviously, yeah, discard it, as always. Um, and yeah, this gives us another cool little item. Yeah, we get a new gun. We clear which is a lot better than the one she has. Um, so, examine. Yeah, so it uses 9mm. It has a laser sight as well. Um, yeah, so it's actually better than that for now, anyway. Um, obviously, there's other upgrades you can get for the other gun, but yeah, this is a cool weapon. Because it's just so much easier to use. Um, yeah, we can feel like we're playing Resident Evil 4. The original, anyway, not the remake. Um, actually, you do get one weapon with a laser sight in that, don't you? I think. Yeah. I mean, I should know. I yeah. I mean, it came out this year. <laughs> I've completed it like three times, but you know, whatever. 
Yeah. Uh, we can go in here. Um, and yeah, we get some items. So more lovely grenade stuff. Um, I feel like there's something else in there. Maybe not. No. Nah. Ah, okay, that's it. Yeah, and then that's uh, the next key. And yeah, that um, Mr. Raccoon is like a thing we just shoot. Um, similar, you know, like the bobbleheads in Seven. It's basically the same thing. Um, and yeah, we can't get in there just yet. So obviously, we got to go down this way. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, just be prepared. That's my advice. Um, for life, anyway, really. Oh my god. Wow. Damn. Oh my god. Fucking liquors. Take a grenade. I should kill it. Oh, beautiful, isn't it? And yeah, let's reload. Uh, I've been kind of, uh, kind of going a bit crazy on the uh, the ammo there. Yeah, obviously you don't really have to kill the enemies. You can run, but um, yeah. You know, knowing my luck, that's not going to go go well. So, yeah. So, we basically just have to open this. I believe it is. Oh, no, that's not the one. It's this one. Sorry. Um, yeah. And basically, this is just where we get the next key. Um, you can kind of see on their shoulder there. But yeah, that's where we get that key. And then, yeah, we have to deal with some some stuff here, so let's just get out of here. We're gonna, gonna have some dogs after us in a second. Why are the dogs dead? What the heck? Why are all the dogs dead? What? Oh, okay, who knows? That, is that a glitch or something? They meant to chase, oh, whatever. Oh, it doesn't matter. I oh. Fuck! Okay, that was stupid. God damn it. Freaking lickers. Lick that. And, uh, as you can imagine, the other dudes are alive now. Which is nice. Yeah, so be careful. Watch yourself. Yeah, so that's actually an optional item which I didn't need. So I don't even know why I came in here. Okay. And uh, things are going smashingly, aren't they? God. Careful, I think there's a lick around here, isn't there? So. Oh no, he's dead. Hmm. Wasn't there another diamond door somewhere? Um, am I might this stupid that I can't even remember. Um, yep. Yeah. It was back that way, wasn't it, with the uh, the chief's room? So yeah, I need to get out of there. Bastard. Yep. 
Yeah, as I was saying, yeah, this is a hell of a lot better, this weapon. Um, but yeah, we just go down there, basically. Um, I don't think we have... Um, there may be dogs out here, so I better be careful. Um, yeah, if anyone can tell me why the hell all those dogs were just dead, I'd really like to know. Maybe the... the Lickers don't kill other enemies, do they? I don't think they do. That, that can't be right. So yeah, this lets us upgrade that bad boy. Um, yeah, I know. I think yeah, we get more of that ammo for the weapon we don't have yet. But yeah, this is um, this next section here, um, which takes us up to the chief room. So, and yeah, I can grab a healing item. Yeah, things really go bad for me in these Resident Evil playthroughs, don't they? Yeah, you may not believe it, but I, you know, I'm actually... I've actually played these games a lot, you know? <laughs> there we go. And... Yeah. Let's so go this way. Um, and yeah, this is the Chief's room. And yeah, basically, um, yeah, there's a lot of creepy sh uh, stuff with this fella. So one, he, he likes collecting all this like weird macabre stuff. Um, yeah, taxidermy things, for example. Um, secondly, he's, uh, yeah, for some reason, I think it's the mayor's daughter. He likes having her bloody, um, like, her dead body around him as well, which is another weird thing. Yeah, just uh, altogether a strange guy. Um, okay, uh, yeah, I'll take a green herb with me. Get rid of that herb. Uh, do I need that? I don't know. Um, yeah, we've we'll, got to dump that as well. Um, like I said, that's um, like an item thing. So, uh, okay, we'll save her. Now, as you can tell. Um, we are going into this room here. So yeah, we have um, that door. That's the the heart key, obviously, which we don't have. Um, yeah, one thing I failed to mention is you actually get three of the keys with either one. So if I'm correct, I think it's like I think the club key or whichever one is exclusive for Leon, and then like the heart key is exclusive for. Um, Claire? I was about to call her Ada. Um, yeah, that's the next game. Well, I mean, Ada is in this game, but... Yeah, here we go. As I was saying. So, yeah. So, you examine this, and you notice it has the heart key behind it, which is pretty awesome. Um, you're going to quickly see... Yeah, okay, so... 23 minutes. Okay. Yeah, and then... Um, obviously, you know, we have this heart area to go into. Yeah, this... Um, yeah, the lion is still here, don't you worry. Or the tiger. Can't tell the difference. Who can, right? Yeah, so we use this. Which lets us go through here. Um, and yeah, that's an area. This is how... Um, this way is how Leon gets into here, basically. Um, the opposite side of that is where the plane crashed. Um, and then there's like a, a crank that Leon gets that you can open this area up. Uh, but yeah, so first we need to go down. Oh, more zombies! Come on. And yeah, we have this uh, this room here. Um, so yeah, we use the hot key and. Yeah, we have some ammo. And this is where we get this as well, which is awesome. And yeah, that is just like in the original. We have the liquor room. Um, if there's any items there you can grab. Yeah. Um, I don't know if you guys remember the liquors in the original. Or the, well, that room in the original is the liquor room, as I like to call it. Um, 
you pretty much, yeah, it's like it breaks through the glass. So, um, but obviously in the original, um, you know, you get a different item in the a key item. Uh, but yeah, as you can tell, we have that box for the jewel. And then if you combine them, we get this, a stars badge. Um, but yeah, it's not quite what it's cracked up to be. Uh, if you turn it around, it's actually a USB dongle. Dongle key. Yeah, dongle key. <laughs> that's, uh, that's my username. Um, but yeah, now we can go upstairs with dongle key. Um, and yeah, that's another thing to board up. I should have grabbed that up here and then gone down, uh, but it doesn't matter. Yeah, we grab that, uh, another defensive item. Um, I'm going to, I should have actually dumped a couple items because I'm stupid, I forgot to. Obviously, yeah, I'm not the most efficient at this game. You know, there's, there's people who actually like, uh, you know, when you watch a speedrunner play this, it's just like everything's perfect, but yeah. Don't expect that from me. I'm just like some guy, you know. Um, and I think I completely friggin' forgot about um, this as well. Yep, so we now I have extra ammo. We can hold like double the amount of ammo, which is badass. Um, also, yeah, I kind of need to get rid of that. We don't we really don't need that, do we? Uh, we'll set the shortcut up there. So, um, yeah, I think that's pretty much everything. We'll get rid of that as well. Yeah, that's fine. And yeah, just just for posterity, posterity, prosperity's sake, um, we'll save up again. Um, yeah. Uh, I believe your ranking isn't affected by saves. Um, at least for like the most part anyway. Um, unless you're playing on like the more difficult settings. Um, because obviously, yeah. Um, I'm sure you guys know this, but you know, um, you get completion ranks, uh, which determine, um, all the items you get and stuff, so. Uh, in the game. Uh, yeah, we'll go down here. Um, well, obviously, it's like the rank you get at the end. It de it's just determined by um, the speed at which you completed it, pretty much. I don't know why I did that. I need to do the other thing first, don't I? Um, Yeah, so we need to do this first, I think, isn't it? And then you do the other bit. Yeah. Yeah, so that's going to allow us to go through there now. Um, I'm sure it'll be fine. So, I foresee nothing going wrong. Oh my god, who's that? Yes, as uh, you probably already know, there is a certain uh, person who we haven't met yet. He goes by the name of uh, Mr. X. Uh, so this is the Pursuer. So obviously, um, if you guys remember, in um, the original game. He's only in the B scenario. Um, but yeah, in this one you actually see him in the A scenario. So that's like one of the coolest friggin' moments in the game. It really is one of them when you're like, this is so cool. But yeah. Um, yeah. The mu as you can hear from the music, you, you will just like, yeah, he's just going to be on you. Um, I think I think he can even come into this area, um, but yeah, for the most part he's now just going to be like stalking this area, looking around, so just be careful. 
Um, and now we can combine, and then, yeah, like I said, I've already explained this already, but yeah, this also has a secondary property where it um, like um, increases your defenses also. But yeah, we'll, we'll dump that. Um, and now, yeah, we want to go to that area, so quickly get that done. Yeah, um, and yeah, as you can hear, they're already <laughs> dudes after us. Um, yeah, let's go out this way. But yeah, leave us alone, dude. I'm not into you. That was really dumb. Literally walked into him. Uh, uh, what an idiot. Yeah, so uh, we'll just keep going. Um, another thing, that broke automatically. Um, there's a funny thing where it's meant to actually just break. Oh my god, I forgot about these guys. Um, yeah, it's just, it's meant to break when you walk in it, but like if you return um, second time around, it's just broken already, which is funny. Uh, yeah, maybe one of the other zombies walked on it as we, were, as we left or something, I don't know. Um, yeah. But yeah, let's go down here. And obviously we're going to the Star's office. Um, I realised I should have literally just gone through that door um, on the other way and come in, like, you know, the easier way. <laughs> yeah, obviously I'm stupid, so... Here we are. We obviously, um, we need to get those uh, two, like, plugs for stuff. Um, but yeah, what you do is you put this in here. And you can do this. And this unlocks the armory. And yeah. There's that weapon we kept getting the ammo for. That we couldn't use. This does not sound like Chris. Um and then yeah, you can actually grab this again because there's something else you can do with this. Um if you're interested anyway. It's up to you. Entirely up to you. But yeah. Yeah, we basically have, um, there's like two areas we can go into here. <laughs> yeah, that's an optional thing. Um, basically with this, um, I didn't show you it before, but, but yeah, you have like this, um, And then you kind of have to like, you know, like press them in order. Uh, like, oh my god, yeah. Obviously, th this doesn't work with me because I have a, like a terrible bloody memory. So, oh my god. Um, yeah, this is gonna add to the atmosphere, but yeah. <laughs> It's actually raining, so I do apologise if you can hear all that. Oh. There you go. And then, obviously, when you've done all that, you get an item. Which is a, a key. Um, well, not a key. It's a, uh, a button. Which you put inside of a thing to do a thing. So yeah, um, it's in this room back down here. Um, yeah, that weapons room. There's some like items you can unlock. So um, I believe the other one is in this room as well. It was just there, wasn't it? Yeah. So so yeah, we have the second one now. So. Um,
Um, uh, yeah, this is fun, isn't it? So it's hmm. this is riveting. Uh, yeah, it takes a lot of concentration when you're as uh, absent-minded as I am, I suppose. Um, yep, yeah, so that one, that one, that one. Duh, duh. Duh. Took me like bloody 20 years. But yeah, we got those now. Um, so yeah, we can go down to that weapons area at the bottom here. And uh, yeah, hopefully, don't run into Mr. X. Um, I don't think we're going to be that lucky though. Bye. Yeah, um, is that one? Safety room. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, so there's this here, and you basically add these. So we have the, like, the two and the one missing. And then basically it's just like, you know, one, oh, um, one, oh, two. One, oh, three. Um, pretty much just do that. I can't remember all the numbers, but it's a bunch of them anyway. Yeah. yeah, and then you just get all the stuff. Pretty straightforward. Uh, yeah, two, uh, 109 as well as another one. That we can grab. 208 as well. I need to get that. 208, 109. Did I do 208? Well, um. Oh. Yep. Yeah. Um, yeah, we've got 206 as well, which is another. Um, photo puzzle thing, so we don't really need that. But yeah, so. Bloody hell, I can hear Mr. X already. <laughs> yeah, so. Um, I'm just gonna combine those two just so we have some more ammo. For now, anyway. And yeah, we're doing alright. Um, I think there's two more upgrades to get for that to have a fully upgraded uh, thing there and yeah it's our best mate here Mr. X it's Mr. X that's my name, that name again is Mr. X sorry that's my uh, Simpsons impression uh, Mr. Plough uh, obviously, that's a great episode of The Simpsons where 
Homer um, decides to make a plowing company, and then uh, Barney makes a better one. So then he has to like uh, compete with his best mate, sort of thing. So. And hijinks ensue. Um, yeah, so we'll go this way. Okay, now I need to kind of remember where to go here. Um, hmm. Yeah, this is the fun part. I think I need to go back the way I came. Uh, is, is anything there? Can't remember. Oh no, that's a Leon room, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Uh, we'll just do another safety save. Yeah, this may as well just be called. Um, I don't know. Saving the game. Oh my god. Yeah, there is something we need to do there, but um, there's an item I haven't got yet, if I'm correct. Um, like the, I think it's like the crank or something. Or um, it's the jack, I think. Yeah, it's like a jack. Uh, and then, yep. Yeah. yeah, I need to go up here. Um, there was an area here, obviously, that I didn't get into, so we'll go here. Here, wasn't it? There we go, we've got this. The wheel. Got another heart. Yeah, um, this is that item we were looking for. One of them at least. Hmm. Oh yeah. Can't open that door yet, can we? Yeah, that's locked around the other side. Hmm. I think um, I can actually jump. Through. Can I? Do that? Let's wait and see. I can hear him. Yeah, we'll take some of this ammo. Um, yeah, we'll dump that for now. And we'll dump that. And yeah, we can dump that because we'll grab it on the way back. So it's in. We need it in this room anyway. So. And. Okay, let's do this. Whoa! That was stupid. I think... Therefore I am. No, um... Yeah, I'm pretty sure... I was meant to jump over... This here. Because I'm... Yeah, I think this is it here, isn't it? Something we have to grab here. Oh no, maybe not. I thought there was some key item here. No, guess not. Yep, and um, that's a sticky predicament we're in here. Okay. 
Was there a room down there? Okay. Um, yeah, no matter how many times I've played this, obviously I still am not 100% sure where everything is. Shack's closed in this version, isn't it? Yeah. Um, yeah, you can actually access that in um, Leon's playthrough, so. But not Claire's, which is very strange. Dude, just leave me alone. Okay, so. Where can it be? I really don't know. Obviously, yeah, there's one more heart place, isn't there? Oh, yeah, I remember now. I remember now. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's down there, isn't it? Um, how can I forget? It's the uh, this little original liquor room, isn't it? Um, yeah, I think this is it, anyway. Uh, yeah, the sound design in this game is Im immaculate, by the way. Um, oh my god. Yeah, if you, um... Fuck me. Yeah, um... Oh no. That's the clover key in this one, isn't it? Oh my god. Stupid. Yeah, um... Yeah, I would suggest... If you get a chance, please play this game with a good pair of headphones. I'm dead. No! I knew that was going to happen eventually. Get to see a good death screen at least. <laughs> That's one thing. Um, but yeah, where are we going to... Where is it going to restart me? That's the question. Um, let's see. Do I have that item yet? Oh. Uh, yeah, I think this is the right. Along the light. Along the light lines, yeah. Along. <laughs> along the right lines here, anyway, so. This is where I meant to go. Um. Get my way. Okay, uh, here we go. Yeah, so in here we get this, which, uh, yeah, this is what we needed. <laughs> and obviously, because I'm so lucky, Mr. X gets to hunt me down again, so. Never noticed that before. Yeah, um, another defensive item here, which is cool. Yeah, but as I was saying, yeah, get yourself a good pair of headphones and play this game. Um, where are we going again? Uh, yeah, we'll go through this one. Easy to go through here. Friggin' hell. Man, I'm having like the worst day ever, aren't I? Um, yeah, we'll just heal up. Um, but yeah, we can go up here now. Um, and this allows us to get uh, one of the other things. So. Yeah, um, also, one annoying thing with this is... Uh, I think this is a guaranteed Mr. X little thing, yeah. Uh. 
And we basically just have to like pull that to the And then that needs to go across the I do love how the uh, you see the skin chunks come off them. Yeah. Um. Yeah, I don't like that. This is a guaranteed thing. It just makes this section so annoying because you've got to, like run around, kiting around. Uh, it just makes it so long and annoying. Oh my god. This is ridiculous. God damn it. Yeah, we just have to push that there and that's it. Then we can actually uh, climb up here and get across. Yeah, we need to go down here first. Um, go and grab that. Yeah, um, that one door can open, is actually on this side, so. Yeah, there we go. See? And obviously, uh, we can actually get that. Um, it was that crank thing I needed, wasn't there? So just to... Uh, And yep, that's the last. That should be the last hot one, which is awesome. Just want to quickly. Yep. Okay, we're almost at an hour here, so. Um, okay, I think I should probably. I think I should have just enough time to get round. So, go around. Into here. Then, yeah, there's just a little puzzle we've got to do here, basically. Um, yeah, so, put that there. Let me use that. I think we need to remove that part. And then, yeah, it's pretty straightforward. Um, just got to go up here. Oh yeah. Oh, wow. Um, there's actually a pop-up let me know I've only got five minutes left to record. That's quite cool. Yes, there's a small gear, and then I think we put the... We have to put the large gear here. And the small gear on the bottom. And then that's that. Um, and yeah.
then yeah, it's quite a straightforward puzzle. Um, none of the, that's the thing with, with Resident Evil. None of the puzzles ever feel too like over the top or like you know you have to think of too much. I'm just gonna skip this cutscene because we have that works. Limited time now, so uh, let me quickly put that up. I'll quick show you. Yep. I'll quickly run across. Yeah, and now I'm going to have to quickly run across to the safe room, and then we're going to end it. Um, and yeah, let's actually hope I can make it in time. Oh my god. I'm assuming once it gets to an hour, it just stops, right? So, yeah. Um, I think as I was saying before, this is like this section done. Um, yeah, pretty straightforward again. Um, yeah, I don't know why I was doing that. But yeah, I'll just save up now. Um, and yeah, thanks for watching. Um, yeah, and I'll catch you in the next one. And uh, as always, have a great rest of your day.